Good evening, fellow collectors, April 29th, 2010. And if you remember, my last video was on an eBay seller called Retro Sports Novelties. And I exposed his totally 100% just plain old junk. Horrific forgeries from seller Retro Sports Novelties. Well, I'm going to show you a seller tonight. I'm going to show you 22 of his items that I've already sold. These autographs, these forgeries that I'm about to show you, are just about more horrific than retro sports novelties. And if you're a buyer of some of this stuff and you're watching this video, this is why I call eBay autograph buyers the stupidest buyers in the world. Most of you people have no business buying autographs. You people who buy this crap, you are half the problem when it comes to forgeries in the hobby industry, in the memorabilia industry. You people have just have no business buying autographs. Do you think that because an autograph is on eBay, that it's authentic, eBay does not filter out forgeries. The majority of autographs on eBay are forgeries. eBay makes a lot of money on forgeries. And you know why? Because you buyers, you dopey buyers, you moronic buyers, buy this stuff. Don't you people do any research? You people make me sick buying this stuff. You guys keep these sellers in business. Anyway, let's get started because I have 22 items to show here. The seller's name is DBK Collectibles. DBK Collectibles. Let's look at this. A lot of the stuff you can see much better on the auction site. So feel free to contact these buyers via the feedback and let them know that their stuff's on video and that they got ripped off for all this money. This is item number 17045-324-8892. A really horrific Tom Brady forgery on a jersey. From seller DBK Collectibles, this buyer, moron, spent $159.05 on this piece of crap. And if any of you buyers want to challenge me or you think I'm wrong, try to get this stuff authenticated by PSA or JSA. I guarantee it'll come back rejected. This is all horrific crap, and you buyers are the problem. Here's an horrific Tom Brady signed jersey, another one from seller DBK Collectibles. This is item number 17044405578. This buyer spent $276.55 on this piece of crap. Holy smokes. You know, you, you buyers, look at the feedback. Did you ever think to ask this seller where he gets all his items? He has as much chance of getting an autograph from these athletes as you do. Think about that. This guy had three different auctions for Tiger Woods signed golf balls. First of all, we all know. Tiger Woods does not sign golf balls. He hasn't signed a golf ball in something like 13 years, 12 years. They're too easy to forge. This seller, DB Collectibles, in three different auctions, sold a total of 19 forged Tiger Woods golf balls, all selling between $50 and $65. A legitimate Tiger Woods golf balls from the early 90s goes for like two, three, four thousand dollars $4,000. You moron buyers bought 19 of these. This one is from item number 170453. 337288. This particular auction he sold six. This is incredible. In fact, if you read the auction description of these uh, Tiger Woods golf balls, it's like he did a wholesale clearance on Tiger Woods golf balls. You idiotic buyers, you think you're going to get a Tiger Woods signed golf ball for $65? You people, you make me sick. This is another one. This is item number. 1704705364502 and in this auction he sold 10 of these forged Tiger Wood golf balls 10 in one auction Tiger Woods forged golf balls all these dopey buyers that buy this crap and he had a third auction for a, a set of Tiger wholesale clearance Tiger Woods signed golf balls this is item number 1704719338904 and in this one he sold 3 he sold a total of 19 forged Tiger Woods golf balls bought by 19 dopey eBay buyers. I think he also sold three of these fake Tiger Woods signed golf gloves. This is item number 170-444-697-490, sold for a whopping $86.75. Everything from DBK Collectibles is a forgery. Everything. This is another Tiger Woods fake signed golf glove. This sold for a whopping $49. 170-4488-15559. Another dopey buyer buying a forgery of a Tiger Woods autograph on a golf glove. And this is the third one. 
This is item number 1704488134984984 sold for a whopping $51 by another idiotic buyer who has no business buying any kind of autographs because they have no you guys have no idea what we're looking at. Did you ever think to ask this guy how how he got so many Tiger Wood autographs with on so many items? Use some common sense, you dopey buyers. Here's a fake Tiger Woods autograph on a card. Item number 1704694055668 sold for a whopping 4104. And another ty fake Tiger Woods autograph on a card sold for a whopping $29. Item number 1704694108044. And now we're going to look at a couple of really bad Alba Pujols signed items from seller DBK Collectibles, an eBay power forger. There's the forgery of Alba Pujols. And this is item number 1704705279879987 sold for a whopping $41.25. If you're a buyer, do you really think you're going to get a legitimate Alba Pujol signed baseball for $41.25? Use some common sense. A Pujols forgery on a baseball hat. Sold for a whopping $22.50. Another plain old forgery from DBK Collectibles. Item number 1704610172288. And we're going to show a really ugly Peyton Manning signature on a jersey. Item number 1704460633346 sold for $129.91 from a dopey buyer on eBay. I'm not going to call these uh, buyers gullible. They're not gullible. They're idiots. There is enough research out there for people not to buy this stuff and to stay away from this crap. I'm going to show you a couple really bad Brett Favre signed jerseys. This is item number 1704415129905. This one sold for a whopping $152.50. Hope these people, I hope these people, these buyers that buy this crap, I hope they don't call themselves collectors. They might be fans, but they're not collectors because real collectors don't buy this crap. It's garbage. It's forgeries. Prove me wrong. You won't be able to because this stuff is all really horrific forgeries. Another forgery of a Brett, Brett Favre autograph on a jersey. This is item number 1704610323380. This one also sold for $152.50. And here's a really horrific LeBron James signature on a... Uh, Jersey, replica jersey. It's a real bad forgery from Le LeBron. Oh, forty-one dollars for this one. Oh boy, one seven zero four seven zero five two one one six zero. Another dopey buyer buying a forgery of a LeBron James signature on a jersey. Now some Jordan stuff, which is really really hor horrific, really bad Jordan stuff. This one sold for a whopping fifteen twenty-two on a card. Item number one seven zero four six seven one eight three three eight two from seller. DBK Collectibles, a power forger on eBay. Another Jordan on a jersey, a forgery of course, sold for a whopping $102.50. Uh, item number 1704447081621. Another dopey buyer on eBay buying more forgeries. You guys, you buyers, keep these guys in business by buying these forgeries. Uh, a Michael Jordan on a basketball, sold for $123.50. This is item number 1704509460085. Another Michael Jordan forgery from seller DBK Collectibles. Another Jordan forgery on a jersey. This is item number 1704607337487. Uh, this moron so, uh, spent $228.49 on this real bad forgery. For a couple hundred more dollars, you could have got a legitimate Michael Jordan autograph on a jersey. These guys are just morons. Look at this horrible Reggie Bush. What the hell is that? What moron would buy something like that on a mini helmet? Item number 1704691393372 sold for a whopping $21.55. And I'll do one more from uh, one more forgery from seller DBK Collectibles. This is item number 1704532022273. Uh, Reggie Bush and Drew Brees on a helmet. Sold for a whopping $7501 and the 22 forgeries and all I'm showing you here from seller DBK Collectibles. And like I will always say, you buyers who buy this crap, you guys make me sick as much as the sellers do. Because you buy this stuff and you keep these guys in business. I will see you guys later.